Thank you, Timothy, for that. Now, police in Eldred Town were forced to low tear gas canisters and fire bullets in the air to separate two rival political groups. Several people were injured in the melee after they were pelted with stones and vehicles belonging to Wasen Gishu governor aspirant, governorship aspirant Zedekiah Kiprop Bundatich, uh, popularly known as Buzeki, were extensively damaged. Elf Elvis Kuske now reports. Trouble started when Buzeki's convoy snaked its way into the town CBD. But supporters waving incumbent governor Jackson Mandago's posters started pelting the vehicles with stones. <laughs> He had earlier made stopovers in several estates within the town without any ugly incident. Hivi leo nilikuwa kwa tribunal ya Jubilee jana ambaye nilipeleka malalamishi yangu kwa sababu ya kura ambazo zilipigwa ambazo tunasema hazikuwa ni za huru na za haki. Kwa hivyo nilikuja kuambia wafuasi wangu ambayo wamesubiri tangu kura ilipopigwa kuambia asante kwa kunipigia kura na pia niwaambie ya kwamba tutangoja jawabu kesho saa 8 unusu alafu nitawaambia kauli ambayo ime, 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 tumepatiwa na tribunal ya JAP Nilipokuja nikapitia kule Langas tukakuja salama nikawasalamia wafuasi wangu tulipofika hapa Turkadero vijana ambaye ni wafuasi wa mpinzani wangu ambaye tumewahi kupigwa mawe hapo siku nyingine wakaanza kurusha mawe akapiga hii gari na ukiona walikuwa wanapiga hizi gari mbili ni zile gari mimi natumia na security yangu hii ilikuwa ni ya kwamba mimi ni target the duo in the run up to the just concluded jubilee party primaries were engaged in a bruising battle for the gubernatorial seat but mandago trounced buzeki nyingine kura zilizopigwa za gavana zilikuwa laki mbili na Elfu kumina tatu, 213,000 zilipigwa kura. Na kura zilizopigwa za women rep ni laki moja na elfu kumina tatu. Kuna tafauti ya la, laki moja, elfu mia moja ya kura. Ambazo inaonekana watu walikuja wakampigia women rep. Na kwa seneta na gavana kuna tafauti ya kura elfu siten. Kwa hivyo tumesema na nimeambia jubili. Hii kura haikuwa ni ya haki na tunangoja wakate kauli kesho. Buzeki accused Mandag of inciting his supporters for the chaos, saying his vehicle was on several occasions been pelted with stones. Si. Na naibu wa raisu walisema hapa Kenya hita muagika damu tena kwa sababu ya kushindania ma, mashindano ya kisiasa. Mm -hmm. Tunona ya kwamba kuna wengine hawajasikia hiyo manena na ndiyo manake wanafanya vurugu kama hii. Kuna mtu wamepeleko hospitali pia mevunjika mkono. Kwa hivyo, nasema tuweke amani na nataka ni muambie. Kunipiga mawe ndiyo kuniongezea nguvu na nitakata kauli ambaye tutaenda na watu wa wazingishu. Mpaka mahali tutaridhika na tupate haki yetu. Men. But when contacted, Mandago said he was away and distanced himself from the chaos. Police officers later beefed up security in the town, dispersing people regrouping as tension remained high with business people forced to close their business early. Elvis Kosgei, KT News, 